Good always trumps evil. Good morning. Today's power of scripture comes from Exodus 1 verse 17. The Amplified Bible states, But the midwives feared God and did not do as the king of Egypt commanded, but let the male babies live. This verse of scripture is from the Old Testament story of the midwives who had been commanded by the Egyptian king to kill all the boy babies born to the Hebrew women. The midwives went against the direct order of the king because they respected and were faithful to God. In spite of the potential for their own demise, these fearless women did the right thing. We also will come upon situations when we must make uncomfortable yet highly volatile choices. We will be painted into a corner and the only feasible way out will seem to be the one in which we must make a choice that might compromise what we believe in or what we stand for. It is in these moments of decision that we must always stay on God's side. A few decades back, a popular mantra was circulating. What would Jesus do? It is still pertinent today. What would Jesus do in such situations where our own personal comfort, prosperity, or even career might be on the line because doing the right thing could jeopardize our position? I know for certain that even in situations that were uncomfortable, Jesus always prayed to his Father and did the right thing. You too can use this same approach. Pray and then do the right thing. God's word is clear about almost every aspect of life and there are numerous examples of ways to handle difficult situations. Studying your Bible and drawing upon the stories, parables, and wise sayings will equip you to know what to do, or at least how to approach God in prayer and praise about the issue. Regardless of what your emotions might dictate, or your past experiences might reflect, always remember that God's good will triumph over evil. It is not an even matchup. Satan is in no way of the same magnitude as our God. So even if you believe you might suffer loss, remember faithfulness to God will always be your trump card and he will reward you double for your trouble. Every day is a good day. It is up to us to make it a power-packed great day. Be blessed. Dr. Joanne